peaceful. How? <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Seriously, I'm okay. Um, sequin bag. Monday morning. Good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of day it is you watch this video. It's a Monday morning for me and the sun is shining. It's been in and out though. The sun has been, yeah, in and out. So sometimes you feel as though it's, mm, I don't think it's going to last this warm weather. It's not even really warm, really. Um, so, yes, yeah, so I'm layering up. So, I've got a man's shirt on. I've got a sequined, it's actually a dress. I've just kind of made it asymmetrical. And this lovely, gorgeous knitted cardigan. So, yes, and do my best to stick within that very peri kind of look for. 2022 which is um, lilac colour so if you're a person that follows trends then hopefully this video or this particular outfit will inspire you so as you can see I've got lilac as well as purple so the pants are from the CGL collection I've had these for many years they used to fit a lot tighter but yeah anyway and I've also got my lilac shoes on. So if you've been watching my videos for the past couple of weeks, you know that um, the lilac shoes are, yeah, they're, they're the only ones that I've got. I do have a second pair, I just don't know where they are. Anyway, um, so I've got lilac shoes and my very, very peri bag that I'm now calling it um, as of, was it Friday's video, I believe, of my last um, outfits of the week, I think. Anyway, back to this outfit. So I'm wearing straight leg pants. Um, I'll give you a little twirl around. And like I said, it's lilac and purple. So it's it's kind of dividing me in two with this dark at the bottom and the light at the top and the sequins. It's more, I suppose it's a little bit more purple than it is lilac, but there are flashes of lilac that's in there. And remember, whenever you are following trends, to have your own take on it. That way you feel as though it's more your trend than what the industry is telling you, if that helps. So, um, I, if you are new to my channel, then I don't really follow trends. I just do what I want to do. I follow my own trend. That's the best way of putting it. So, um, yeah, so I've gone for an asymmetrical hemline, which is the cardigan, the dress, and also the shirt and um, the cuffs are just unbuttoned and that's how I like to wear it. I buttoned it all the way to the top. I was thinking whether or not I should put a tie on because I do like wearing ties. Maybe, maybe when I wear this again or on an outfit sport, yeah, I do like to wear ties. So I'm going to finish this off with my purple gloves. So let's put those on. There we go. Yeah, that's nice. So as my hands move around my body, it kind of interrupts with the lilac a little bit. I like to talk with my hands anyway. <laughs> and then I'm going for the very peri bag. It is quite light in colour. But the situation is, it is what it is. Um, for those of you who don't know, I bought this from a charity shop a, a couple of weeks back. And yeah, it just spoke to me. It was new. It's like, how did you know that I was going to be doing the very peri look? <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I'll be carrying that bag today. So I'll bring you down. Also, my channel is about DIY fashion, where I show you how to refashion garments. So what I do on my Friday videos, where I show you outfits that I wear throughout the week, I actually team them with garments that I have refashioned, garments that I have designed, pattern drafted and also sewn, and also some high street pieces all mixed in. 
So it gives you an opportunity to think about your wardrobe or what you want to refashion. Hopefully you'll be on the refashioning track um, in order to make sure that we do our bit for the planet. So let's get into the video. It's Tuesday. And yes, I'm maintaining the very Perry look again today. Some of you may recognize this. Yes, it used to have, well no, it still does have. It has like bow cuffs that I am not wearing today. I'm not going to wear that today. I'll wear it some other time, I'll tease you. Um, but this was a man shirt and this was the top section of a dress. And it's gorgeous even if I do say so myself. And I am pairing it with a lilac beauty skirt, which I have worn a couple of times as well. So yeah, I'm sticking with the very Perry lilac look, and I am going to be adding some accessories to it. So the accessories I'm gonna go for are some gloves, which are the purple ones. Like I said, I've said this before, haven't I, that I will be looking out for lilac coloured gloves in the charity shops. So there we go, but this goes really well. What I'm wearing. It's a bit of gloves. And I'm going to go for, no, not the very cherry bag. This one. How? <laughs> um, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Seriously, I'm okay. Um, sequin bag. I have, I have spotted this a couple of times. I think last week's video, I said that I was going to repair this because you have to be really very careful with this because it's got sequins all over it, which is gorgeous. So I spent the weekend mending it. So hopefully no more will decide to depart from the bag. I'm going to put it cross body like so. So it just brings in the skirt yeah, good balance between the lilac skirt and the top and also my footwear and gloves. This really finishes off the look. So I'll bring you down so that you can have a look at the bottom half of me. My corset belt. What can I say? I enjoy it so much. This will get a lot of wear. You just step back so you can see. Oh, I'm wearing it with a skirt, a pleated skirt, and it goes so well. So I have. When I actually made this, I was wearing pants. It's like joggers or something. Um, but it will look amazing in pants as well as a skirt, whether it's a pleated skirt or a straight skirt. It's just gorgeous. I'm wearing it with a polar neck, my jewel polar neck. You have seen this many times, especially if you are not um, new to my channel. Um, black rings, a combination of silver and black brace, bracelets, and my earrings not gonna say anything else other than that <laughs> my hair um let me see yeah it needs washing <laughs> i'm on a hair journey what can i say um so yes i just thought i'll just give my hair my hair a little bit of airing <laughs> so yeah i'm loving it actually this is nice and the footwear that I am wearing are some kitten heels, which I'll show you in a moment. And the bag that I'm going to go for is this one. You've seen it a couple of times. I've had it a very long while, actually. Um, yeah, it's, it's it's got a character all of its own, but it goes well with what I am wearing. And I can wear this belt so many different ways as well. So I will actually show you the different ways in which 
um, you can actually wear this belt. Whether or not you wear yours similar to, to the way I will show you how I'm going to be wearing mine. So there's about two or three other ways I can actually wear this and I can't wait to show you. Um, but this looks very chic and the other style's a bit more contemporary, which is me. <laughs> what can I say? So I'm going to show you the back. Now bring you down. I'm all about inspiring, motivating and sharing ideas for upcycled fashion. If you're into that sort of thing, it definitely is worthwhile subscribing to my channel. Not only that, I'm on the Patreon platform where there are three different levels. Check the description and I hope to see you there. Let's get back to the video. Yes, I'm sporting a tie, and then there's a tie, a man's shirt, the pants, I have CGL collection, and yeah, <laughs> purple jumper. I'm a bit more purple than actually lilac, but the lilac is there. It definitely is, wouldn't you agree? Yeah, I'm sure you would. Um, so yes, so it's Friday, so I thought I would just put on something that's a bit glitz and glamour and throw in a, a man's tie and just you know give it a bit more of a different look with the man's I was going to go without the tie it's like no Colleen just go with the tie so that's what I did um so yeah so my my, my shirt is out shirt tails <laughs> are out the cuffs are undone kind of look that I look that I love and I'm wearing my wedges that I've had for years. <laughs> um, it's a bit more comfortable though. And yeah, that's it for Friday. A bit glitzy with sequined jumper. And um, I was in two minds about which bag I was gonna go for. This is a safe option, which will be my purple one that, you know, for those of you who watch my channel will see this a few times. And I do like it, and it does go well with what I'm wearing because of the purple and because of the sequins, and also the sequins that are in this jumper as well. But it's too safe. It's 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 too safe. So I decided um, I'll wear this one another time. You can guess which one I'm going to go for, can't you? Yes, my very Perry bag. <laughs> yeah, this is what I'm going to go for. Um, it's it's just a tad, a tad a bit lighter than what I would like it to be in order to go with this outfit. But it's not safe, but it's still a good option. It really is still a good option. I was thinking about putting it across body, but no, it will take away from the time the sequins and the and bag will just be the focus point. I don't want that to be the case. I still want the bag to blend in, so the best way to do that is to actually carry it by the top handle here, and it's kind of in proportion with the lilac that's in the shirt. And given the pants, and which are also purple, which are very similar purple to the jumper, you know, an opportunity for the bag to shine against the purple, and also the pants to shine, you know, to, to give um, the outfit a balanced look. And like I said, I've gone for my wedges, which does have a tinge of brown in them. Well, more than a tinge, actually. It's, it's the actual front of the shoe. Anyway, it still goes. <laughs> so let me bring you down so you can see what I'm talking about. So I hope you enjoyed my video, my outfits for the week. Like I said earlier in the video, that my outfits are uh, different mixtures of where I actually get them from. 
and I hope it inspires you more than anything to think about refashioning, to think about upcycling garments so that we can do our bit for the planet. So if you like my outfits of the week then please do give it a like. Under the like button is the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell so that you receive notifications of when I upload my tutorials about refashioning garments and also my outfits of the week. If you have any comments please put those in the comment box below and please do check out the links that are in the description because I will actually put links to whatever I have refashioned in, in that section of the video so please do check that out and I will see you next time. Thank you for watching.